Welcome to the Joyous Kingdom. In today's video, we'll be doing a brutally honest review on OK Bears, the Solana project that is apparently the next Board Ape Yacht Club. This is a very, very new project. It is trending though. People are all talking about it. It's a new Solana project. So we're going to talk about it. We're going to do an in-depth review here. If you're excited to learn, smash like in that video, subscribe to the channel, join the kingdom. If you're already following me on Twitter, if you're not on my Discord down below in the description, you're only hurting yourself. It's true. As you know, the goal of this channel is to instill the knowledge and confidence it's going to take to navigate this metaverse on your own one day. So if that sounds good to you, get your five free socks using my Weeble link, the Crypto Socks trading platform made easy for you and we'll get started and for any companies or brands you want to get in contact with me just email me at georgeofficial at gmail.com and the okay bears are listed on magic eden the solana marketplace and also on OpenSea, the uh, ethereum marketplace but now they're uh, accepting solana projects you can see here 158 solana floor price 1.1 million solana traded 5.4 thousand dollars for 10,000 items it is kind of like the board of club in the sense of the artist it's very simple yeah it's very simple and if you look at the chart here no crazy crazy inclines or anything like pretty chill here's the okay bears twitter page okay bears is a culture shift a clean collection of 10,000 diverse bears building a virtuous community 130,000 followers and they actually do a remarkable job on their Twitter page as far as branding really getting together this whole okay bears we are all okay we are okay community feel this this reminds me of like Berenstein Bears type of art and type of feel I actually fuck with it like I really really love these these animations they're coming up with and the the captions a shit ton of engagement here people are really excited about this project and I know a lot of people thought that Gary V bought in because he said oh I have one responding to this person saying he should buy one because of this chart but I don't think Gary knew they were talking about okay bears I think he just saw V friends so he said I have one uh, and then right under right after he says I have a phantom wallet is what I was saying <laughs> I don't think anyone saw this one because a shit ton of people saw this one and I went through discord to make sure everything looked good not too many channels stuff like that everything was secure everything looked good and here's the okay bears website here if we scroll down they said okay first section is called the park a place to fit in a space to stand out very cool stuff. I really like this. OK Bears is a culture shift, an extraordinary brand built by ordinary people. In a polar world of winners and losers, heroes and villains, artists and builders, the middle ground has been left barren. That very ground lays the foundation of the park where it is OK to be OK. An immaculate collection of 10,000 diverse bears that gives you exclusive access to the park where together we build a virtuous community that will transcend the internet into the real world. Through meaningful member only merch drops, outdoor campaigns, exclusive live events and collaborations with indie businesses and world renowned bands, brands, we create a community centric globally recognized brand that is for us for good together we are okay and we'll get back to the founders uh, once we finish the website Look at their manifesto bear with us comes refined as long as you're kind progress takes patience our needs are aligned so bear with the grind kick back and unwind good vibes and community is one hell of a ride i feel like dr seuss life in the city it's okay for me work for tomorrow we all agree there's time to sip coffee dance and roam free catch up at the park or relax on a tree carefree living our style is to be true bury no grudge no judgment no spew live for tonight the twilight anew bear with me friend and i'll bear with you i really fuck with this i think this is great a lot of projects aren't putting in this type of effort and these soft skill type of uh efforts if that makes sense kind of like the things that people wouldn't think that are important are very important and having a manifesto where people know exactly what the kind of community they're getting into is fucking important and so i really like that they're doing all this it's not surprising that they've got such a strong following right now and here we have the blueprint a bunch of sections that you can choose on to go to different sections so we'll start here first with the workshop so they're gonna be giving back by doing an online community activation real world outdoor marketing campaigns and one of one csr auctions in the gallery here Championing artists in the NFT space online and in the real world, they're gonna have a gallery, a place to marvel at the 10,000 bears, a curated fan art display. They'll feature a curated page of the best OK fan art, uh, OK bear fan art, in its various forms of spotlights and the artists and communities behind them. And then some in real life pop up exhibitions. Very cool. Next, we have the park. And this is just their Discord. I'm going to go to Studio. They're looking to gain priority access to future collections, art, community, lo-fi, and endless stream of good vibes. Future NFT pro drops, <laughs> probably nothing, who knows what that means. Community, lo-fi, mixtapes, as we said, art, and folk tales. So they're really, really trying to build the brain here. That's obviously the most important thing here to this project, and that's honestly really refreshing to see. We have Boutique now, beautifully crafted in real life merch, prints, collectibles, and swag. They're definitely looking to do some merch, limited edition collectibles, and they're looking to partner with some kind of fashion brand to kind 
kind of get started in the real world. Next, we have the bear market. So the bear market is an ecosystem of Web3, Web2, and in real life sales channels exclusive for OK Bear holders built through robust partnerships with industry leading brands. They're looking to make a bear market with the Magic Eden Marketplace and building a partnership there where OK Bear holders will be able to buy and sell OK Bears with the member only perks. We want to have a token gated e commerce and Shopify holder access, um, holder only access to exclusive merch through their seamless integration with Web3 and Shopify's robust, robust e commerce platform. And then in real life, OK Bears pop up stores. As, as everybody wants to do. But again, these kind of things that the pop-up stores only work if you have a strong enough brand. So it's good that th this is the direction they're headed. And I think uh, I think it's a good thing. Full disclosure, I don't own any OK Bears as well. So under platform now, a series of initiatives championed or championing thought, leadership, and innovation across the Solana blockchain and its leading communities. Keynotes, conferences, and meetups are looking to be a, a leader basically in the space and get people just into this space, leave and push conversations that are kind of forward thinking. That's great to see. Community grants and copyright licensing through the Honeypot incubator that invests in the community initiatives. The OK Bears team will allow limited grants and licensing options to outstanding startup concepts that grow the OK Bear brand and service offering. Now, finally, we'll go to the founders in the team here. We have Kais, co-founder, Subi, co-founder, Rio, digital artist, Mandy, illustrator, Mooney, illustrator, Rama, concept artist, Teak, web developer, David, full stack dev, GG, game developer. We have Bow Wow, motion, de uh, motion designer, Nukla, creative writer, and Chauvin, software engineer. So we'll just go through the ones that have any kind of socials. We have Kais first, co-founder with tertiary degrees in graphic design, art history, and branding. Uh, Kais brings his strategic experience in building and leading design projects for many global brands, including UNICEF, United Nations, Unilever, Greenpeace, Ford, Dell, and Olympus. Subi, the co-founder, another co-founder, previously an engineer, now an emerging leader in developing and nurturing Web3 communities. He brings experience working in a strategic design consulting firm engaged in leading NFT projects for established international teams. I'd love to see some kind of credibility somewhere. I don't know. There's only a Twitter, but then we have Teak, web developer with a background in industrial design and extensive certification in UX practice. Teak has also worked in a wide range of design and creative projects including UX, UI, and web development for global startups and, com and government agencies. And finally, David, full stack dev, in addition to his master's in computer science, respect for that, David brings the extensive industry experience in the development for digital transformation projects across Asia, including major governments and e-commerce projects. We have Kais's Twitter page here, 11,000 followers. I think all the people on the team that I saw do a good job of posting on their own, building their own personal brand, growing a good following on their own, in addition to just them being associated to OK Bears. He also is the co-founder of this other project called bitbirds if we go to their twitter page here they're also on the solana magic eden marketplace 3333 bird nfts to celebrate the power of the pixel exclusive to the solana blockchain and this is their magic eden page floor price of 3.95 solana and this is what they look like um Okay. And then on their uh, on their website here, they're a limited collection of 3,333 fearless and proud birds living in the Solana blockchain. Uh, simplicity, minimalism, and lightness of the pixels contrast against the attitude, flair, and confidence confidence exuded by these bite birds or bit birds. And for the roadmap, there is just a limited airdrop, wave one, mint um, one third of them, airdrop, unleash the snake, merch store, mint another wave, airdrop. Ultimate Sacrifice, Great War, not a whole lot of information, just a lot of lore mainly, and just building up the brand. Next we have Subi, another co-founder. Uh, he's also worked on the Bitbird, so I assume they knew each other before, so that's good. It at least gives you something to look at and be like, okay, is this project fucking dead? Or are they doing okay? Are they still alive? Are they still even posting? Are people following the project? It's a great way to be able to tell because we just solved the Zuki. That's just important. Experience is important. Credibility is important. We have Teague, Web Dev at OK Bears. This is his Twitter page. Does a great job pushing the brand, supporting the community, building his own brand. And same with Dev Watt, uh, working Dev, Web Dev at the OK Bears. And finally, we have their Instagram page here. I think they did a good job. Would love to see some video content, some animations, anything really. You know, you can even get these characters, like the ones, the avatars. If you have one with a cigar, cigarette, nothing. Okay, well, if one has a cigarette, you could do a little animation of the smoke going out, a little caption, something relatable. I think that'd be a great idea to post on TikTok, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels, all the things. So yeah, I mean, I don't know, I don't know how strong of a community Bitbirds is. I really haven't um, done too much research in the Solana blockchain, but if you are interested in getting the OK Bears, that would definitely be a good place to start for your own research for this project. But as far as some constructive criticism, I would just say um, continue building the brand, I guess. You know, find ways to maintain a little bit of demand, 
not really just hype it got really hyped up for the, uh, there for a while really just try and build off that continue to push the brand like you've been doing and start throwing some animations i think that's my my main bits of advice code word if you made it to the very end so that i know is gonna be i am okay all right y'all i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you learned something if you did smash like in this video subscribe to the channel join the kingdom if you're already following me on twitter if you're not my discord down below in the description what are you doing you're only hurting yourself out here if you haven't regarded your five free socks use my weeble link i can't help you it's five it's five free socks free money for you helps me out directly we all win it's a crypto socks trading platform made easy if you want to see more of me right now click on one of these boxes on the other side of me until next time continue on your joy age continue to learn and be grateful you're alive watching this video.